Hello everyone, this is Moot, and this is our third episode of our Worm PvP series. We're on the Worm Desolation server, and in this episode, we're we found some iron, and we're going to figure out what we're going to do with it. So, in order to find iron, I went ahead and continued to uh, mine straight in, and as I went, I analyzed these rocks. So, analyze, you know, it takes 20 prospecting, and then as you analyze, you can go ahead and you can see what's around you. Okay, it tells me I found faint traces of iron west of south. So we know right now we're we're facing west. Okay, and I went west and then I went south. And I analyzed as I went and I know that my iron ore is there, but just for the sake of, um, for those who may not know, okay, southwest. So this is what I did until I finally came upon my iron ore. After I found my iron vein, I went ahead and I mined a couple. Okay. And I created a fire, like in my previous tutorials. And I put the iron inside the fire. And you know how to make a campfire. You take kindling on type of... Uh, kindling with flint and steel. Okay. Then I went ahead and made a mallet. And now we're going to make a small anvil. Okay, so let's go ahead and combine these bad boys together. Oops, put that in my inventory. Combine together. Small anvil. You only need one of them, baby. Only one small anvil. Blacksmith is going to be two. And we failed. Let's keep going. But you can tell. I mean, look how fast this is. Super fast. So up to 25, it's going to be 1.0 gain. After 25, it's going to start decreasing. Um decreasing your skill game but still it's super fast i mean i mine for 20 minutes i already have 70 mining so it's not that big of a deal it's super fast get you in get you into the server all right uh put our small anvil there what's the next next up is of course uh well a large anvil is important so let's go ahead and make our large anvil 33 p chance of success oh perfect we made our large anvil and what we really need is a chisel, right? Because we have to make uh, a mine door, which is important. Got our chisel and our hammer for blacksmithing. And then we also need to make, we need to make our nails. We have to make our nails in order to make our loom so we can make our meditation rug. So loom, we need small nails. So let's go ahead and make a couple small nails. Three small nails, please. We need sh sh 10 string. Okay, so we, we need to really forage for cotton. Okay, planks. Great. So that's enough. We're gonna throw our anvil in there. I'm going to go ahead and feed this fire so it keeps going. We need to make a chisel. So let's go ahead and oops, use the handle on the chisel. Create stone chisel. Perfect. Alright, now we need to go make our mine door to protect us from all the nasty little creatures like crabs that are trying to kill us. And then the mine door doesn't have to be super, super exciting. But hopefully we have enough strength to make a mine door. Okay. We don't have enough stone masonry. That's okay. Uh, what we can do in order to get our stone... Our masonry up is make bricks. We need to have bricks anyways. Why do we need bricks? Because we have to make a forge. Uh, that's all covered in other in other episodes. But for the sake of this one, we'll go ahead and show you how to make bricks. I like using the crafting window. Uh, I think I feel like it's less less ticks. Or less clicks, ticks, clicks. Stone cutting. Let 
Mason trees at six already. This is great, huh? Fast. Make the mine door. I don't know exactly what skill you need for mine door, so I'm just gonna keep checking. Because we should be at ten. There's our tenth. Make the mine door. Okay, so we need more. I like to pick up more, combine it, more bricks. You need at least, you need 11 bricks for your forge. And then you need also 11 mortar. In addition, you're also going to want to create an altar once you priest up. And we'll create a small bowl before we leave to the white light. So now we have enough for our forge, which is great. And now we can see, I mean, we're at 20. We're cruising right along here. There's the epic curve, so we can now make our mind door. Although we're at, you know, 1, 9%. don't really like doing 9%. Uh, but let's go ahead and see if we have success with our door. Let's get rid of you. Let's bring you on over here. And the other thing we have to make sure we actually have a large enough. I don't think we have. See, so our, we need to drop all the stuff in our inventory except our stone chisel with the hope that we can actually carry more rock so we can make a mine door. Okay, so let's drop everything. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, I think we can do it. Perfect. Here we go. And nope, close. Nope. Come on, buddy. It's like. Gambling. So every time you fail, it takes away from the amount of rock that you have. And eventually, you're going to get it. Still at 9%. Where is that? Let's pick up this, see if we can pick up this last piece got it all right let's go ahead and drop that it always drops on front of you we pick it up we double click it you can prove it if you want to um, I'm not interested in doing that right now you activate it you right click on the border that's closest to you and you build mine door okay whichever borders open if you have a border that's not open uh, meaning that if you have a border that has a fence on it then always the front one well usually the front one's open as well and just like that okay we have a safe and secure place and we're safe oh my goodness that feels much better all right we have have our bricks okay we can leave the bricks there for now let's go ahead and pick up the rest of this stuff and we need to make the loom so in the next episode we'll make the loom and well before we leave we'll go ahead and make our let's go ahead and make our bowl that we're going to use in another following episode for our altar mm. large anvil for the bowl Well, all right, all we need is one. Here we go. Got it. All right, we're making progress, boys and girls and kids of all ages. All right, see you next episode.